Hey everybody, Joe with Modular Home Hunters, and we are in sunny Plant City, Florida at the Palm Harbor Model Center. We're taking a look at their Trade Winds 2. This is a big house. It's 2,720 square foot, four bedroom, three bath. I can give you a couple shots of the outside, but they always box these in, sorry. Let me see if I can get this up in the air here. Anyways, let's take a look at the inside. All right, come on in. Let's check this out. Look at this. This is great. Beautiful. And first things first, since we've got it here, it's like we got an air handler. We got an air handler. Well, you return and nice little coat closet. Cool. Look at this place. Big high ceilings, nine foot ceilings, beams. Look at the kitchen. I've been in smaller commercial kitchens than this. Everything's big in here. Look at that. Look at the island. And I like the dark cabinets. It works in here, even though it's, you know, a lot of dark cabinets. It doesn't make this look small at all. Nice beams, lots of recessed lighting. Really nice. I like the backsplash. These cabinets. Tile backsplash all the way up to the ceiling. Stainless steel hood. Beautiful. Let's check them out. See if they slam. Nope. Check the drawer. Soft clothes. No slamming around here. Cool. Look at this. It's like a bowling alley. Is it a pantry? No, it's just cabinets. Yeah, that's a lot of them, though. Look at that. Built in micro. Tons of cabinet space here. You're going to need it. I mean, if you got a house like this, you, you're probably going to have some chow around. And uh, the luxury plank, vinyl plank floors pretty much throughout. Look at the size of this. This is like about a 10 foot island. <laughs> Giant sink built in micro and they put a quartz top on here which is really nice a stone top prep style faucet you could fit eight people at this counter easily and you know, they only put four stools there beautiful kitchen big all right so let's head back here and we've got a den and it's like a little getaway den back here i can imagine people will be back here playing games or doing something homework whatever you got a bedroom on this side, and it's a nice size bedroom. And everything, all the rooms in here are big, obviously. This is almost 3,000 square foot house. We'll walk in closet, head through here. This bedroom's even bigger. And so, this would be like maybe, you know, it could be a mother in law or just an older kid or whatever. And another walk in closet. Fairly generous closet and bathroom too. Dual sinks, vinyl back through here too. Big mirrors and decked out with tile, tile bath and robe hooks and tile backsplash. This thing has got a lot of features in it. Yeah, so the LVT, or the LVP comes into here, but they do have some carpet back here. But this is a back end of the house at this point. Hopefully we don't have someone coming in. Yeah, you wouldn't have a lot of sand on your feet in Florida, so. And from these rooms, here's a peek at everything. Wow, nice, big area, huge. And around the corner, and we got linen closet for the bathroom here. I'll get back to that. And then look at the size of this laundry room. It's like most people's kitchen. Look at all the cabinets. Nice sink and tile backsplash. Cottage door, L LVP everywhere, obviously. And walk-in utility closet. So that's nice. Lots of storage. 200 amp service. So there's your jumbo laundry room. And bedroom four. And this is also a nice size room. And I went the wrong way. <laughs> walk-in closet. Nice. Yeah. All right. 45 degree door and bathroom three so for this end of the house back here if you got someone back here like say a mother-in-law or older kid or whatever and it's a nice bath this is all decked out with tile and everything and tile backsplash yeah nice bath three all right so from this end of the house take a peek into this beautiful living area nice dining room with a slider. I think you could probably do French doors there if you like to. And here is the living room with huge horizon windows. Light pouring in here. 
Beautiful fireplace, real fireplace. You can put a gas unit in there too. Nice stance. And look at the architectural accents, the way they vaulted the ceiling and all. It's a very interesting look, you know, the perspective and everything and the dish ceiling. It's a good look. Rich, nice. Huge pillars. Let's just take it all in here. <laughs> nice area. Beautiful. I mean, you're going to have a lot going on here. And since you're going to have a lot going on in the master, they got a nice retreat here. So we'll head into the master through the retreat. You can get away. There's going to be a lot going on in a house like this, I would say. So you can kind of hide out in here and just decompress or whatever. You can get up and have your coffee in the morning or whatever it might be. A little carpet back here, but look at the size of this nice big master bedroom. Through the sliding barn door, we have, of course, what you'd expect, a beautiful master bath with the big walk-in shower. Light pouring in the horizon window, fully tiled. This is a decked-out house. I like how that drain is there. And you got a privacy toilet in here, the window. And they've got all the dark hardware. I like it. Soaker tub. Big horizon window up there. I like all the way they wrap that. Cool. Nice tub. Tiled out. I think interesting uh, porthole mirrors. <laughs> it's nice. It's different. I'm sure there's options for that, but not bad. Rectangular sinks with tile backsplash. This is pretty decked out. Very nice. So there's your master. Lots of space. We'll carpet back here again, but... That's okay back this far. And then a nice walk-in closet with all hard surface storage with some shelves and drawers and premium no-wire shelving and a big dressing mirror. Nice, deep, pretty wide walk-in closet in the master. So there's your master. I was like, like this retreat. That's cool. And you obviously got doors there. You can close that up and just kind of chill out if someone's still sleeping or whatever. And there is your master bedroom. Beautiful. All righty. Take a peek at what you'd see out your door here. <laughs> a lot. <laughs> Probably a madhouse. <laughs> Hive of activity in here. Yeah, something. And, yes, indeed. Oh, a walk-in pantry. Very nice. Good size and all hard shelving. I like that. And to top it all off, there is indeed an office spare room up front. A little bonus room or office. And that's the Trade Winds 2. Let me spin out of here. Take one more look at this. Very nice. All right. Here we go. <laughs> Let's talk about the price. All right, this time out, we got the Palm Harbor Homes Trade Winds 2. It's a big house, four bedroom, three bath, 2,720 square foot, triple wide. The average price, as shown, is $393,180. That includes high efficiency AC, setup and delivery up to 100 miles, as usual, with Palm Harbor. And you can set the house up differently, obviously, as usual. Make it cost a little less or make it cost a little more if you like. Anyway, if you like these videos, think about giving us a thumbs up. Consider subscribing. And, of course, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. And until next time, happy hunting.